Warwick, thanks for being here at the Lowy Institute. Um, day two of the carbon tax here in Australia. Just wanted to ask you a few questions whilst you're here in the building. Cool. Um, why do we need a price on carbon? Well, the main reason is because that's the lowest cost way of getting people to change their behaviour, both the consumers as well as major corporations, to get them to do things with less carbon emissions. And over time, long-term investments will be encouraged and will start moving to a lower carbon economy. Warwick, how does carbon pricing work? Well, the basic principle is if you put a price on carbon uh, where it's produced, so when we burn coal to generate electricity, that emits carbon dioxide. So fortunately for this sort of problem, there are a very small number of very large emitters. So you either put a tax on an emission of carbon at the source, or you um, force per, uh, firms to buy permits uh, to be able to emit. Um, either way, that price gets into the production decisions of the corporation, and then they pass those prices down to other companies who use electricity or uh, who buy aluminium to consumers. Uh, prices change throughout the economy and people start to respond to those incentives. Can you summarise the main features of Australia's carbon pricing system? Well, it's quite a complicated scheme. It started off as a very good idea, but with all the negotiations in the political space, it changed quite a lot from the simple principle to being quite a mess. Um, the way it starts is a pure carbon tax, where the price of carbon is set at uh, $23 a tonne on July 1st, 2012. It rises by 4% a year, and so by uh, July 1st, 2015, it would be in principle around $28 a tonne. Then on July 1st, 2015, it switches to a carbon trading system where firms, instead of paying a tax to the government, have to buy carbon permits in a market. And the way that works is that there will be a certain number of carbon permits the government will create. Some will be given to firms. Um, many will be auctioned. Firms buy and sell these, and that sets the price.